here at Marmor Snow Fest today. We were just outside watching the six mile, six dog race teams take off. And now we're inside warming up with some hot cocoa and watching the curling here. We've had plenty of opportunities to embrace our inner eight year old today. Just like all of you guys have been doing on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. I love logging on and checking out how you guys are using the hashtag Remember Winter. Uh, people have been having a lot of fun with it, so keep it up. I'd like to send a big congratulations out to Laura V from Balbo, our first Remember Winter Photo Contest winner. She posted this photo of her winter wanderings, and it's that easy. If you want to win one of these toques, and why wouldn't you? These toques are awesome, right? Simply upload a photo of you having some winter fun to our photo contest page at ontarioshighlands.ca. A little fun fact about these toques is that they were handmade right here in Ontario's Highlands by a local artisan in Hastings County. We're keeping it local. And thankfully they're keeping me warm, especially this past weekend with all the snow we've been getting. I couldn't have asked for a more magical day out with winter dance dog sled tours. It was absolute perfection. I was actually really surprised by my dog sledding experience. At the races, understandably, it's fast paced, lots of energy, all about speed. Whereas when I got out with winter dance dog sled tours, I was surprised by how quiet and relaxing and ultimately peaceful it was. Especially when you get out there and you realize it's just you and the dogs in this vast, open, beautiful landscape. If you haven't tried dog sledding, I highly suggest it. I've got a real fun adventure lined up for next week in Lanark County. I won't divulge too much, but I will say that I'm showcasing a couple different ways to keep warm while having fun with winter, all thanks to cottage fishing adventures and Tay River reflections. But don't wait until next Cocoa with Carly to get all the details. You can follow along with the road trip on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. I'll be posting real-time snapshots of all the shenanigans I'm getting up to. So follow along, and until then, cheers.